Welcome. My name is Yara Willard, and I'm a clinical herbalist on Vancouver Island. And today I was out taking my dog for a walk, and I stumbled across a patch of turkey tails, one of my favorite immunomodulating mushrooms. These are found all over Western Canada. And as you can see by this, they have a multiple colors that look kind of like a turkey's tail. The Latin name is Coriolis versicolor, or Trimedes versicolor, distinguishing basically the variant of colors that go along it, going all different colors. So why do we want to use this? Like I was saying before, it's an immunomodulant, which means it doesn't stimulate the immune system or depress it. It brings it to a higher level of function. That's a good thing if we want to increase our vitality or prevent ourselves or our families from getting sick over the winter months. So I like to use this mushroom usually from September onwards through to through the winter until spring. What, how we do this is we decoct it, which means we slightly boil it or lightly simmer it for between a half an hour to two hours. We then strain that off and use it as a tea or we drink it or we put it in the fridge and use it as a smoothie base or for a base for a tonic soup. This is a great medicine and it also has antiviral and anti-inflammatory um, properties as well as it can be used as a good liver health protectant. So for people who have liver diseases or just want to increase their liver function, this is a great medicine to use. Yeah, I'll give you a little look at what they look like. Here they are growing on the wood, as you can see, all along here. Easy to harvest. You basically just pull one off like so. These little bits then can be stored and dried or thrown fresh into a batch of water and made into a tea. Now the other ways we can use this is we make a tincture out of it. Now to do this, we like to make what's called a dual extraction because the alcohol has the ability to pull out certain properties and the water has the ability to pull out certain properties. So. We make a tea and then we filter that off, store the tea in the fridge or in the freezer. And while we're doing that, we make ourselves a tincture, which is using 50% alcohol, macerating at a two to one or a three to one, whatever we can fit into the, into the container. And then we take that tincture after two weeks of macerating and we add it to the tea, which we've frozen, and put the two together and make a dual extraction. This is probably the most beneficial way to use this medicine, but it's also just great as a tea. So I hope you get out and try it and it's widely abundant and easy to distinguish. So just a great choice for the novice herbalist to start playing with. Hope you enjoy it and uh, get out and find some yourself. Thanks for joining me.